everything about the way you uh, control the stage, the way you play, the way you perform, it just feels like you were born to be there and you seem so natural in the place that you belong. Been traveling these wide roads for so long. My heart's been far from you. Ten thousand miles gone. In my darkness, I remember promise words we are going to So enter to the good Lord, and He'll wipe your sin clean. Take me to your river How I want to go Yeah, Lord, won't you take me home Go on Take me to your river Cause I want to know Yeah, babe Oh, won't you take me To your river, cause I wanna go. What's your name, man? Uh, my name is Ricky Duran. I'm 29 years old. I'm from Worcester, Massachusetts. My name is Ricky Duran. I'm 29 years old. I'm from Worcester, Massachusetts. But eight months ago, I moved here to Austin, Texas. Austin is the live music capital of the world. I've been playing out like five nights a week at different venues, and there's always something to do in the city. To me, music is family. It's like every time I perform, I feel like it brings me that much closer to my parents. They came from Guatemala. When they were 21, they moved to the States to give me and my family a better life. I'm definitely living the dream that my parents had for me. There's no way I would be able to do this without their influence. Thank y'all so much. I was six years old when my dad bought me a guitar. Literally, I just never put it down after that. I remember my dad, like, the life of the party, always smiling. The energy he brought to a room was just amazing. I don't know, I guess it just struck a chord with me that I want to be that person that just brings happiness to the room. Looking back at the videos, you can see how happy my dad was. He was just brightened up. I wish I could go back and appreciate those moments a little more because he didn't tell us how stressed he was and that really took a toll on him. He took his own life um, when I was 22. I was devastating. You never expect that kind of thing to happen. Uh, it changed my life, you know. I uh, definitely fell into a dark place, for sure. So in the note, he uh, basically said that he wanted me to live my best life and be, be happy, which is ironic because I wish I could have told that to him. It was really, really difficult, but Ricky was honestly the one that held us together. And then when my mom got sick, he wanted to come home and take care of her and be with the family. So she was sick on and off for three years. So I feel like he was kind of on hold for those three years. Unfortunately, she didn't get better. Um, she passed away last year. One of the last times I talked to my mom, she kept saying, live your best life, follow your dreams, be happy. You know, it's similar to what my dad had told me. And I just, I just carry that around with me. I feel like they're the reason I have this opportunity. I, I just feel like it's meant to be, and I think that my mom and dad are watching me. As the 
these chairs turned around, it just gave you even more confidence. Like, man, I'm just gonna let it fly. Yeah. And your tone is great. You have the aggressiveness when you need to have it. Great stage presence. I'd love to be your coach, dude. Thank you so much, appreciate that. I heard immediately what a beautiful tone you have, what beautiful control you have. I love that song personally, uh, love Leon, and you elevated the song. What kind of music do you like to cover? I grew up uh, listening to blues and rock and roll, and uh, I've been venturing into more soul and R&B. Yeah, and I just hear your voice doing so many beautiful things over all those different genres. I can help you pick the right song, and I know you have the vocal ability to be so great on this show, and I'd love to work with you. Thank you very much. You gotta make a choice, my friend. Ricky, who would you pick as your coach? I think I want to go to that river. I picked Blake. Yeah! Oh, that's my boy! That's my boy! Oh, my God. Hey, come meet Darius Rucker. Hello. Yes, oh my God. Hi, it's so Very nice, nice to, to meet you. you. How are you? When I walked in and I saw not only Blake, but Darius Rucker, I was blown away. Hootie and the Blowfish, you know, that's like a huge influence of mine. Did you have to go to jail and put your house on? Now, Ricky's one of those guys that I hate because I want to sing like that. But every time he opened his mouth, whatever came out was perfect. Ricky is a star. Chris Robinson is an idol of mine, and you definitely have some of that in there, yeah. for sure. To have people here as talented as both of you guys, it's a little bit frustrating because you go, why aren't they on the radio? Why don't they yeah. make it, you know? It's ridiculous. There's no reason that either one of you two should be going home. Yeah, y'all should be you. real happy. Y'all gonna kill it. Thank yeah. you. Thanks. The thing that I love about Ricky, he's got tons of gravel in his voice, and he's also got that thing about him when he performs that you just want to see more. Something about your tone is really cool to me. You sound like a star. You have that something special about your voice that feels extra magical. If I were to pick, I would pick Ricky. Ricky, you have this star quality and stage presence. You just believe you 100%. There's no nerves. And so I would have to give it to Ricky. I'm just gonna say that I'm picking the winner of this battle, not because I think somebody is better than the other. It's just based off of this song. The winner of this battle is, is Ricky. Ricky Duran, congratulations, you're moving on to the knockout. She never mentions the word addiction. 
in certain company Yeah, I should tell you she's an old father After you meet her family Says she talks angels Says they all know her name Talks to angels. They call her out by her name. Yeah, baby. She don't know no lover. Oh, no man I've ever seen. Yeah, yeah. yeah to her it don't mean nothing. But to me, yeah, me, yeah, me, everything. Oh, yeah, she talks to angels. They call her out by her name, her name, yeah. Oh, she talks to angels. They call her out now. small town and I live in a small town Rob the down a small town all oh, those small communities all my friends are so small town my parents lived in the same small town my job is so small town provides little opportunity small town Have myself a ball in a small town Let me lay down about it to this small town That's a small town just like me Oh yeah No, I cannot forget from where it is that I come from I cannot forget the people who love me Yeah, I can be myself here in a small town and people let me be just what I want to be Oh, yeah Got nothing against the big town Still hate it enough to say, look who's in the big town But my bed is in a small town Oh, and that's good enough for me I was born in a small town I can breathe in a small town Gonna die in a small town Oh, that's probably where they'll bury me hey! Oh, yeah, yeah So here we are This is my venue on Broadway. I moved here in 1994. Really what I found out over the years was Broadway was more of just a place to kind of hone your craft and that's why I was excited to put in one of my own venues. Yeah. And now this has become home to, I don't know how many voice contestants. You're always gonna be welcome to come here and play anytime you want to. And let's make some music in here. So what are you gonna be singing, man? I'm going to be singing You Are the Best Thing by Ray LaMontagne. Oh, my God. That's going to be killer for you. Dedicated to my girlfriend. She was with me during my move from Worcester to Austin. And funny enough that we were passing through Nashville, and we stopped in here for a drink. So, in here? In here. Literally wow. a year ago today. That is crazy. You are the best thing. I chose this song because Alyssa's been there for me, supporting me. Cool. The night before my blind audition, I got a call from my sister saying, that Alyssa had to be rushed to the hospital. She was having a stroke. And, uh... 
Amen. <sighs> Luckily, she got out of surgery and she made a full recovery. And we just had a huge cut of artists and now we're gonna lose two more, so lock into the moment, have mm -hmm. fun with it. I know you guys have been through a lot together. If you're yeah. thinking about it and you're singing about it, then we're gonna feel that. <laughs> Been a long day, baby. Things ain't been going my way. You know I needed you here to clear up my mind. All the time, and baby, the way you move me is crazy. It's like you see right through me, you make it easier. You please me, you don't even have to try. Everything about the way you uh, control the stage, the way you play, the way you perform, it just feels like you were born to be there and you seem so natural in the place that you belong. Performances like that, man, you always deliver a solid performance and people relate to you. That's why you're gonna be here for a long time, man. Congratulations. You are the best thing. Ricky has that working man allure about him that Bruce Springsteen had, that John Mellencamp had. On a downtown train. Artists that everybody just feels like they can relate to them. Get mad at it. All right. Get Worcester on it. The fans gave Ricky this song because they know he can nail it, and they will not be disappointed. Another yellow moon has punched a hole in the night I missed. I climb through the window and down to the street. I'm shining like a new dime. The downtown trains are full, full of all them Brooklyn girls. They try so hard to break out of the little world. You wave your head and they scatter like clothes. They have nothing that'll ever capture your heart. Yeah, they're just thoughts without thoughts. Be careful of them in the dark. Oh, if I were once the one, you chose to be your only one. Oh, baby, but can't you hear me now? Heart attacks, 
Yeah, they stay at the carnival. But to never win your back, baby. Will I see you tonight? On the downtown train. Every night, every night, it's just the same. Oh, you leave me lonely. Will I see you tonight? On the downtown train. This song speaks to me because after losing my father to suicide, and then on top of that, my mom got sick and passed, and it's like, when's it gonna end, you know? But it feels almost like a form of healing, singing this song in particular. My dad introduced me to blues, and we used to play a lot of Albert King together. So my sisters are gonna be so happy to see me playing this song. No way, yeah. you're singing Albert King? I know. love that song. I'm so proud of everything you're doing, Rick. Mom and Dad would be so proud. I think my sisters were a little worried about me for a bit. <laughs> so what? it's really nice to be like, I'm OK. Look. Born on a bad side. I've been down since I began to crawl. If it wasn't for bad luck, you know I wouldn't have no luck at all. Hard luck and trouble, been my only friend. I've been on my own ever since I was 10. Born on a bad side. I've been down since I began to crawl. If it wasn't for that love, you know I wouldn't have no luck at all. I can read, never learn how to write. My whole life has been one big fight. Born under a bad sign. I've been down since I began to crawl. If it wasn't for that love, I said I wouldn't have no love at all. That ain't no lie, no.
every week. You, you show us why you belong here and why we expect to see you go very far on this show. You're just a, a, an exceptional performer. I want everybody at home to take the remote right, right now, rewind that performance, <laughs> and try to find anything that's not magical about it, from your singing to the guitar playing. When I find myself in times of trouble, Mother Mary comes to me, speaking words of wisdom, let it be. And in my hour of darkness, she is standing right in front of me, speaking words of wisdom, let it be. Let it be, let it be, let it be, yeah, let it be. Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. And when the broken-hearted people living in the world agree, there will be an answer, let it be. For though they may be parted, there is still a chance that they will see. There will be an answer, let it be. Let it be, let it be, let it be, yeah, let it be. There will be an answer, let it be. There is still a light that shines on me. Shine until tomorrow, let it be. Yeah. Oh, I wake up to the sound of music. Mother Mary comes to me, speaking words of wisdom. Let it be. is Ricky Duran. A year ago, I was playing shows in small bars, and I wasn't thinking about anything else but becoming a successful musician. It's cool to hear you push yourself, and it really feels like you're giving it more than you've ever given it. My mom's dying wish to me was to pursue my dreams. I feel like every step I take, she's gotten me through. It's more than just chance. I feel like I'm destined to be here. I think Ricky could have a successful recording career after the show, making albums that could bring back that rock blues thing. But you can do it. all forms of music, all genres. You have to get mad at the song and just know this is what I have to do to win this show. Oh, down a dream. I got a feeling that you'll be hearing him on the radio in the next couple of years. <laughs> Down. I had the radio on. I was dry. Trees went by. Me and Dale was singing. Little runaway. I was fly. We were running down. 
out of dream that never would turn to me Working on a mystery One day it never release Yeah, I'm running down the dream Felt so good Like anything was possible I hit cruise control And rub my eyes The last three days The rain was unstoppable It was always cold No sunshine Dark. I put the pedal down to get some time. There was something good waiting down this road. Lord, I'm picking up whatever is mine. Come on. Yeah, rolling down the dream. The devil would come with me. Working on a mystery. Going with Congratulations to our two finalists and all four of our coaches who were represented tonight for the first time in a long time. It was a great season, but the moment we've all been waiting for is here. One last time, here we go. The winner of The Voice is Jake Hoot.